everyone. Welcome to our presentation on Summer Reading Club at the Vancouver Island Regional Library. My name is Julie and I am a children's librarian at the Nanaimo North Branch of the library. And with me today, I have all of my good librarian friends. I've got Sheila and Sheila is at our Harborfront branch and Lee, who is also at our Harborfront branch. And then we have Ginger, who is in Ladysmith. Wonderful. So we are here today to talk to you about Summer Reading Club. And some of you might have been part of Summer Reading Club in past years. Um, so you might know some of the stuff we're going to talk about, but we've got some new stuff, some new exciting stuff to tell you about as well. So to start with, how about I tell you how it works? So every year we give Summer Reading Club a different theme. And this year, our summer reading club is Crack the Case. There's the poster there. So it's about mysteries and spies. And also, you can actually read anything you want for summer reading club. So if you're not big into mysteries and spies, read whatever you want. But yeah, we're calling it Crack the Case this year. And how Summer Reading Club works is go to the library and what happens is you pick up a little package. Oh, it's stuck. There we go. You pick up a little package. It looks like this. Just a little envelope. And inside is all kinds of Summer Reading Club goodies. Package of things. So we have stickers and tattoos. We've got bookmarks. We have color change pencils, um, which I don't think my hands are warm enough to change it, but hopefully once you get your packages, if you hold out your pencils, oh, Lee's trying to see if one of us can change the color. One, we'll reveal on the count of three. One, two, three. Mine's the same color. <laughs> Mine kind of works. A very good experiment, <laughs> but they do change color. So everybody who signs up for Reading Club gets one of these pencils. The most important thing in the package though is this. This is your Summer Reading Club reading record. And what you do with this is once school has finished, you start keeping track of what you're reading over the summer. So it opens up and it looks a bit different than other years. Uh, so this will be new to all of you. So you open it up and inside it's like a little game board. Ooh, and it follows along and it goes and it goes and it goes and it goes and it goes. And what you do is every day during the summer, if you do some reading and maybe, you know, 15, 20 minutes, whatever you and your parents decide on, you do some reading and you fill in one of these circles, color it in or put a check mark in it or something. And then the next day, if you do some more reading, you fill in another circle and you fill in circles, 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 circles until you get to the question marks. And when you get to the question marks, that means that you've read for a week. And that means you get to put one of the special stickers on here. And those are also in the package and they'll help you solve different mysteries in this little reading record. So that's kind of how that works. And you keep on going and going and going and going and it looks like it's a big game board, um, but there's plenty of days in the summer to do lots and lots of reading. And you can read whatever you want. Um, some of you maybe come to the library all the time and you could read, you could pick whatever books you want out of the library, or if you like listening to books, you could pick some audio books up, or maybe you have like a tablet or a iPhone or something, and you want to read on there, you can do that. All kinds of reading counts, um, whatever you want to read. Yeah, you can put it in here. You can also, if you have like little brothers and sisters at home, um, you could read to them if you want, and uh, then, if you do that, it's really good because then you can fill in a circle in your reading record and your little brother or sister can also fill in a circle in their reading record. So it's kind of two for the price of one. And the reason you want to do that is because every time you get to one of these special put a sticker on spaces, you also get to fill in a draw slip. And then you bring that back to the library and every week we're going to be giving away prizes and we'll show you some of the prizes a little bit later on. So stay tuned for that. So that's kind of how this all works. Okay, so we hope you'll come down to the library and get one of these. 
Um, you can also, your parents can register you online and you can participate just online. If you're not coming down to libraries right now, you can do everything um, just on your computer and your teacher will have more information about that. Okay, so that's what I wanted to tell you about. Um, so now let's see what we want to talk about next. Yes, thanks, Julie. That's really great information. Now, we're just hearing recently that a theft has been committed at the Nanaimo Harborfront branch here. And we're just waiting for some instructions from Mission Control about how they'd like to... Oh, hang on. Uh, they're contacting, contacting us now. Uh, Julie, can you go ahead and open the feed and we'll see what they have to say. Attention all agents. The VIRL Summer Reading Club prize medals were set to arrive at the Nanaimo Harborfront branch. The delivery truck arrived on schedule and Rodney was supposed to receive them. When Rodney arrived at his desk, he ecstatically tore open the package only to discover that a hole had been carved out of the bottom and all the SRC medals were gone. All customers in the branch are now suspects. Vancouver Island Regional Library's Tales the Whale's ultrasonic hearing perked up when he discovered this horrible injustice to his library and to all of you. He is on the case and ready to solve the mystery of the missing medals, but he can't do it alone. He needs your help, the VIRL Summer Reading Club spy trainees. The suspects in this case are as follows. Nancy Nanaimo, gift shop display artist. Shirley Sidney, author of Treat Your Shelf. Albert Alberni, fisherman. Renee Renfrew, chef at the Gold Plated Cafe. Hope Hardy, coach of the Hardy Boys hockey team. Nora Nanaimo, ocean animal archivist. Charles Cowichan, newspaper reporter, and Matilda Massett, welder. Tails has hired specially trained agents to teach a spy academy where each week you will learn a new lesson to help you solve the mystery. Are you up to crack the case and ready to enroll? Well, there you have it, Julie, straight from Mission Control. So kids, visit your local library and to join and sign up for Summer Reading Club and Spy Academy. And you too can join Tails the Whales and his special agent to help them craft the case. Thank you. Now we're gonna hear from special programs and events happening this summer with Ginger. Thanks, Lee. That's great, what a mystery. So this summer, we have asked some very special people to entertain us and teach us. The first person, who we have asked to join us this summer is Anne Glover. And she tells stories and she animates those stories with a single piece of string, sometimes multiple strings actually. Um, so um, you can register to, to go to this Zoom event at our uh, library website. Oh, the sunglasses came to me, that was cool. All right, so the next special person that we have coming to our your computers is Zoe C. And she's the illustrator who um, illustrated our posters and our reading records for the Summer Reading Club. She's really great. And she is going to teach um, kids. She's, we're now two sessions. Um, one of them is going to be for five to eight year olds. And one of them is going to be not for nine to 12 year olds. And Zoe is going to teach you how to create your own special detective characters. We have another event, Carmen San Diego dance, cl dance class with the Souk um, Dance Studio. Um, and so for this event, you can actually get up and dance around. Again, it's a Zoom event, so you can do that on your computer. And then finally, we have our favorite magician. Yes. This is Leif David. He has, probably many of you have seen Leif at our libraries. This year is going to be a little bit different and Leif is going to give us a show on the computer so you can register on our website. And he is always entertaining, does amazing tricks. And this year he's going to teach you a couple simple tricks that you can do when you're on your next Zoom meeting. All right. So next. Sheila is going to tell us a little bit about some of the prizes that we can win. Thank you, Ginger. So 
Do you remember when Julie was telling you about those draw slips? Well, for every week, if you come in and fill in a draw slip, all of your libraries will be having weekly draws for book prizes like this, or like this, and like that, or that, or that, or this one, that might be my favorite, and that, and that, and even these. And puzzles, and sparkles, and what really happened to Humpty Dumpty? Oh boy, and if you don't think that's enough prizes, if you finish your whole reading record by the very end of the summer, you will win a Summer Reading Club medal. And I am the superest Summer Reading Club reader of all, obviously, because I have all these medals. But psst, these are last years. So, I think that's all we have to say about prizes. Is that right? So back to you, Julie. Wonderful, thank you, Sheila. So yes, now we've told you all about Summer Reading Club. Great prizes, medals, lots of wonderful programs that will be happening virtually. You can come into the library and you'll be able to pick up our take and make kits where you can do crafts and things. There is so much fun happening in the library. And registration begins on June 14th, um, but you can come, you don't have to remember that date. You can just come, you know, when school is all finished for the year, come down to the library and you'll be able to do join in, um, join in on all of the fun. All right, so thanks so much for listening to us and we hope we're gonna see you in the libraries this summer. All right, bye everybody. Bye. bye.